Hours after a Nairobi court ordered the pilots to return to work, the Kenya Airlines Pilot Association, Kalpa, said its members would resume duty by 6 a.m. on Wednesday, the deadline stipulated by the judge. Kalpa spokesperson said the strike is off and the pilots are back to work. Despite the announcement, Kenya Airways' latest online update showed that just 19 flights operating on Wednesday, fewer than 26 scheduled the day before, although it said on Twitter that normal operations should resume by November 12th. Officials at Nairobi's Jomo Kenyatta International Airport said the airline was still struggling to clear the backlog from earlier flight cancellations. Passengers at the airport said they are cautiously optimistic after being forced to reschedule their travel plans because of the strike. Kalpa launched the walkout in defiance of a court injunction issued last week against the strike prompting the government to threaten the pilots with disciplinary action. In a breakthrough for the Belingard airline, Justice Anne Mwaure on Tuesday ordered Kalpa members to resume their duties unconditionally by 6 a.m. Wednesday. Kenya Airways, which is part owned by the Kenyan government, as well as Air France KLM, is one of the biggest in Africa, connecting multiple countries to Europe and Asia, but it has been running losses for years, despite the government pumping in millions of dollars to keep it afloat. Kind of Stefano, Ebro TV.